Hi guys, welcome to Phaser Friday. Today I want to talk about using through speed in a phaser. Now, I can't say I've used this before and I'm not sure exactly when I would, which is more of why I wanted to make this video because I love hearing your feedback in the comments. Like, okay, if you have used this, when, tell me where, tell me how, I wanna like, wanna know these things. Or if none of you have, maybe this isn't useful or maybe this is something that we can all put our heads together on and find like the right moment in the music or just in programming in general when this is helpful. So without further ado, let's look at through speed in a phaser. So okay, I'm gonna start with a very simple phaser. So I'm gonna take my spots gridded group and I'm gonna put them at full and I'm gonna make the second step my lights at zero. And I felt that this was the easiest to see if I changed my transition on both steps to zero. So it's a snappy type phaser. Now, if I pop into a matrix, if I set my speed two to 60, then it would go from 60 to 60 because that's the default. So I'm gonna set it to 120 so that my speed from X is 60 and the two X is 120. Now I can see as it's going along, it's fun because it'll like go one way, it'll like, it looks like it's adding groups and then it'll go the other way and then it'll feel kind of random for a second and then it'll go to feeling like it's, you know, a phase of 90 and then it kind of repeats again, obviously, because it is a phaser. And so I think this is fun. It's like, it's something interesting, it's unique. But again, because of the different varying speeds, I haven't found the right place to put it in a show. Or maybe I am just like looking at it wrong. Maybe it works better on pan tilt or on something else. Um, this is where I'm at. And then if you combine it with phase, it can get like really wonky because now you actually have this phrase spread out and then this speed is what's changing. So yeah, I do love that it changes direction. So again, I said this is video is gonna be quick, but this is how you do it. This is like what it can create. I don't know when I would use it yet, but I really, really want your feedback, right? And I think everyone else watching this will watch your feedback because clearly I don't have a whole lot right now. So anyway, with that being said, thank you all for watching. Thanks for coming in this Friday and I'll see you next Friday.